The Southern California jury is now about two hours into its first full day of deliberations in the BART shooting trial. Former BART police officer Johannes Messerly is charged in the shooting death of passenger Oscar Grant, New Year's Day 2009. ABC 7's Laura Anthony is live at the courthouse in Los Angeles. Laura, we know the jury has asked one question anymore. Not today, not yet, Eric. Uh, that question was actually asked by the uh, what we're calling the old jury. The jury was reconfigured yesterday. As you said, this jury has been deliberating now for about two hours. Now, you may remember, of course, this case went to the original jury Friday afternoon, but those deliberations had to be restarted yesterday when a juror was replaced. We now have eight women and four men deciding Johannes Meserly's fate. Yesterday, the judge revealed that the original jury sent him a note Friday afternoon asking whether Meserly could have been provoked by someone other than Oscar Grant when Meserly shot Grant in the back. Provocation is part of one legal theory that could lead to a manslaughter conviction. The judge and our own legal expert cautioned against reading too much into the question, but it does give us a little insight into what this jury is considering behind closed doors. It's always dangerous to infer a lot from a jury question, but I think we can tell some things about uh, this question. First of all, this jury is moving very fast. Even though they've had a very short time to deliberate, they are down to the substance of this case. Secondly, the jury is very smart. The question they asked is an enormously sophisticated question. I doubt that 90% of all practicing criminal lawyers uh, would have a ready answer to this question. So it shows they're really thinking about the case and thinking about the legal issues. What do we want? this trial. There have been small demonstrations outside the courthouse this morning. There is a group on the corner with a banner that reads, quote, we're all Oscar Grant, justice now. By our count, the current jury has deliberated about four and a half hours. We are told that they will get their uh, regular scheduled lunch break at about 12 o'clock today. That would be from 12 to 1.30. And then if they stick to the normal court schedule here, they would then deliberate until about 4 o'clock. We are also told that we will get now at least one hour's notice if they do reach a verdict. But at this point, uh, not a word, no indication of anything other than deliberations going on this morning. Live in Los Angeles, Laura Anthony, ABC 7 News. Laura, thank you. A uh, reminder, as soon as there is a verdict, we will interrupt programming and bring you the outcome live. You can also go to abc7news.com and sign up for a breaking news alert to get an email or a text message.